Here they come. Field of nine for Mohawk Sevens. Mohawk Series Championship. And they're off and pacing. A tentative start for White Star Jojo on the outside. Appeared to be squeezed. There goes D.L. Lindy up in search of the front. Famous War is leaving hard. The Tourist on the inside is third. Presidential Lies outside fourth to the flank of Glenmark Lucky and Southview Senator. The post-time favorite is eased away a conservative sixth. With a whole lot of class from seventh. Then it's back to White Star Jojo. And McIntyre is trailing. Trevor Ritchie up front with Famous War quickly to the quarter in 27 and one fifth. D. Lindy racing along in second and is already attacking on Famous War. There goes by Arjon with D.L. Lindy in the backstretch. Two more lengths to the tourist staying in from third and Glenmark Lucky is flushed first over from fourth. Southview Senator has second over cover from fifth. Presidential Lies is sixth in line. Third to last for the whole lot of class. Then White Star Jojo and Mackin Tower. D.L. Lindy taking over the entry right behind him. Famous War and Glenmark Lucky. The tourist on the inside Fourth. Second over fifth for Southview Senator, 55 and three. They made that half. Glenn Mark Lucky on the outside is on the attack on D.L. Lindy on down to three quarters. Famous War is in the box. Southview Senator yet to kick in from second over fourth. Whole lot of class sweeps up on the outside fifth at the flank of the tourist. Then presidential lies. Second to last is White Star Jojo on the outside and Mac in Tower is trailing D.L. Lindy. On the inside, Glenmark Lucky on the outside and Southview Senator is asked to respond now from second over into the stretch off three quarters of 123 and two and is this field ever tightly grouped white star jojo looking dangerous on the extreme outside they're strung out five across southview senator whole lot of class a huge long shot between pacers but southview senator finds more on the end of it with whole lot of class whole lot of class got it by a head on the line from southview senator and white star jojo 85 to 1 upset in the Mohawk final for Paul McKenzie and whole lot of class. Return to the winner's circle was number three, whole lot of class. Winning the championship final of the 2001 Mohawk series. Longest on the board at 85 to 1. Actually, his closing odds were 89 to 1. Three year old Bay Gelding, sired by bilateral from the Albatross Dam style Hanover. Owned by the Merck's stable of Scarsdale, New York, trained by Joe Pereira, and driven to victory by Paul McKenzie. His first in four this year is a life's mark of 153 and 2. 2001 Mohawk Series champion. Whole lot of class. Thanks to the crew from Sea Joy and Magic FM in Guelph. Lisa Richards and Kevin Kelly on hand uh, as they were back in the fifth race to make the trophy presentation. And winner's circle congratulations to whole lot of class and winning driver Paul McKenzie. Shocking upset tonight in the Mohawk final. Paul McKenzie aboard, whole lot of class, pulls off the shocker, 153-2. Uh, and two. Uh, Good driving finish there, just got up to win it. What was your approach going in? This was a Colt who uh, you knew was a long shot, made a break last time around. What was your uh, pregame strategy if you had one? Well, we're just going to try, he made a little break last week. We're just going to keep him flat and uh, go around and maybe stay to the fence and hope to get a check was the main objective. Now, you know, knew the Colt a little bit. You drove him a few times last year. In fact, you put his mark of 54-3 and three on him at Sarnia. So uh, you must have known he had the ability to compete. Yeah, he's a nice Colt. And like I said, last year he went in 54 over Sarnia, and he had showed that he had some talent. And that's only about his fourth start back this year. And he was a little gravy behind the gate there tonight, and I was just trying to get him back, and I was following Randy. I figured that would be a good horse to follow. All right, an electrifying win. Congratulations. Thanks, Greg. Paul McKenzie winning driver in the uh, big shocking upset, 153 and 2 tonight with a whole lot of class. Horses making the way out for race number 8. We'll have a quick look at the changes.